What's up guys, I'm going to do another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video and this time we're going to be talking about the Black Ops 3 beta and all the details you need to know about it. So Activision has officially announced the dates for all platforms for the beta. So we previously knew that the Black Ops 3 beta on PlayStation 4 would start on August 19th but we didn't know when uh, the PlayStation uh, 4 beta would really end or uh, when the Xbox beta would begin and the PC beta. Uh, we didn't know all these things, but now we have official confirmation. So, the PlayStation 4 beta is going to go from uh, Wednesday, August 19th, all the way till Sunday, August 23rd. And the Xbox One and PC beta is going to go from Wednesday, August 26th, through Sunday, August 30th. So, um, there is a, a pretty big gap in between, so uh, there's a, a week... Uh, in between the start date for the uh, the PlayStation and the uh, Xbox One and PC, but the beta is only five days long. So this is what a lot of people are upset about: is that since it's only five days long, is that really enough time for you know people to uh, get uh, a good amount of playtime in and really? Um, kind of find some bugs and stuff in it because the purpose of this beta is to make sure that the game is um, ready to go for launch and that there is no like huge problems at launch that there's no guns that are super overpowered or huge out of map glitches or just bugs and stuff like that and just get a lot of this stuff worked out but with only a couple days to do um, bug testing and have the public play it uh, I guarantee there's gonna be a lot of bugs that are found but if it was like a week long, there'd be a lot more found, and it would there would just be so much more benefit to being it like a week long. Um, and it doesn't really make sense because most betas for video games have been like a week long. Like Battlefield's betas have been like a week long and stuff. And uh, it's really kind of disappointing to see that it's only a couple days long, five days long. But I suppose if you have both an Xbox One and a PS4, or like a PS4 and a PC, then you could potentially play the beta for up to 10 days, but that'd be, uh, you know, pretty expensive if you don't have that already. So it's kind of disappointing to see that the beta is only five days long, but uh, also in terms of what we're going to see in the beta, so there's probably only going to be about four or five multiplayer maps included in the beta, probably around 15 guns uh, available. It's not going to be a whole lot of guns or maps or uh, probably even camos. I don't think we're going to get to see a whole lot of stuff. It's just going to be a, a pretty a lockdown build of uh, everything we're going to see. So hopefully we'll get some good guns and we'll get some uh, good gameplays out of this and get a, you know, find a lot of bugs and get a lot of things worked out but uh, we're gonna have to see uh, when it actually comes out so in terms of when the actual timing for the beta will start uh, most of the Xbox store and the PlayStation store they update at like 3 in the morning or just early in the morning 2 or 3 in the morning so uh, if you really want to play the Black Ops 3 beta like a second it goes live you're gonna want to be um, Waking up super early on Wednesday or staying up really early or staying up really late on Tuesday. So uh, Tuesday the 18th, you're going to want to like stay up late. And around uh, 1 or 2, just sometime early in the morning, that's when the beta is going to go live and you can download it. Uh, we don't know if you're going to be able to preload the beta. So it basically means you're going to be able to download it before it actually goes live so like the week before it comes out you can download it but you can't actually access it uh, we don't know about any of that yet uh, they're probably going to give us more details about stuff like that at gamescom in the upcoming weeks and yeah thanks for watching guys tell me what you guys think of all this in the comments down below do you think the beta should be longer do you think it's uh good do you have a playstation 4 and an xbox one you know are you going to be able to play both betas tell me in the comments down below thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time.